Hello everyone, and uh, welcome to yet another Thomas figure review. Uh, today I got um, a figure from the 30th anniversary range coming up for you. Uh, this being the pre-cyborg General Grievous, which I picked up uh, a few months back. Now this is a really cool figure. Uh, gives you an insight on how uh, Grievous looks before he becomes the cyborg general we all know. And love or hate. Um, as I said, this is a really cool model. Um, it looks somewhat like some sort of desert warrior. Uh, I haven't read much on the background from the planet which he comes, but he is apparently, um, let's see, he's apparently a Kalish. I'm not quite sure if I pronounced that correctly. Um, and his real name is, in fact, um, bear with me if I do not read this correctly, uh, Kuiman Jai Shilal. Uh, I'll put a bubble in here so you can see how it's uh, spelled. And I expect the figure. As I said, this is a really cool figure. It comes with uh, this blade here. It can be removed, of course. And put in the hilt on the back here. Like this. And there we go. And then this rifle here, which I'm not quite certain what it is. I'll just let you have a look. That's kind of strange, but apparently it's a rifle of some sort. Uh, his articulation ain't all great, um, but he's a pretty cool figure and he's up to scale. He is a towering monstrosity compared to most other figures. Um, so, anyways, his articulation is a, uh, a ball hinged, both are ball jointed neck, ball hinged shoulder, and swivel forearm, uh, swivel waist, swivel hips, and ball hinged knees. So, there isn't much articulation on him, but still, he's, uh, he's quite a cool figure. Uh, I'll just read. I'll just show you the packaging here and quickly read from the back. This is, this is actually a pretty cool picture. Picture up here. Some sort of artwork. And there's the back here. Um, pre start with Grievous, a fearless warrior. Grievous is one of the uh, greatest military soldiers of his people. Uh, as is the Kalish custom, he wears during combat a bone mask passed down to him from ancestors. His outstanding military record uh, catches the attention of the banging clan. Who wants to use his expertise uh, in um, for their growing separatist movement? So this is General Grievous. Um, his mask here, by the way, can be removed, so you can see his uh, true face. It's kind of hard to get back on, but uh, anyways, I'm going to give you a look here. It's real ugly, real ugly guy. That's the face of mother only only a mother could love. Um, the cape here is kind of loose, I'm not quite certain if that can be removed. I haven't tried it, and I'm probably not going to try it. Uh, I'll just see if I can put the mask back on pretty quickly. For the sake of the review. So we won't scare any children. Look at this guy's face. Ah, I'll have to leave that to later. Um, anyways, as I said, this is a really cool figure. It also comes with another 30th anniversary coins. Um, and if you got the chance, I definitely recommend picking this one up. It's kind of, kind of a unique figure. Uh, I haven't seen this one before. And definitely one uh, I will be looking out for to get a uh, carded version of. So, uh, oh by the way, rating. <laughs> uh, I'm probably going to give this figure 8 out of 10. Uh, he's really cool, he's something new. Uh, but the articulation is lagging. Uh, and the sword has a problem fitting under his hand. Not fitting, uh, it has a problem staying in his hand. But apart from that, it's cool, really cool. So, this is it for now. I ho really hope you enjoyed this, and um, until the next time, then may the force be with you all.